looking at Canada for help in harnessing another source of power, not from the ground, but from the sky. Jennifer Kirby reports. A delegation from China touring a wind turbine site south of Calgary. These businessmen, engineers and a high-ranking government official want to learn more about wind power generation, in particular this special turbine design. China has passed a renewable energy law uh, recently. Uh, China has been uh, also put a priority on the emission controls and also want to reduce uh, pollution. The potential market for wind power in China is worth tens of billions of dollars. Most of China's energy right now comes from coal, just a tiny percentage from the wind. China makes its own small turbines, the rest come from companies in Europe. The country wants more wind power, thinking these vertical axis turbines can help. The Calgary company that owns them says they have several advantages over the typical propeller type turbines used around the world. And the main difference is that all your mechanical equipment is on the ground. So it's very easy to install, very easy to get to, to maintain. We think this, uh, this design uh, is more cost effective and also use uh, less uh, materials. Brent Harris is hoping for a business deal out of this visit to partner with a Chinese firm, take this technology to China and invest in more research and development. I think there are huge opportunities. Um, sustainable energy technologies is a really good example of a Canadian company that's come up with some good ideas that are marketable overseas. Uh, we have other companies in Canada that are doing similar things. Uh, are you connected to a grid? So far, the Chinese haven't committed to anything, but they're showing a lot of interest and giving the idea of a technology partnership serious consideration. Jennifer Kirby, CBC News, near Pincher Creek, Alberta.